Here we go. The comeback fight is on. Mark Baker v Alexei Olienik. Here we go. Can we get a win here? Can we propel ourselves back into the uh, the good the good rankings of the heavyweight division? What is up, guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we are playing some more EA Sports UFC 3. It's episode number 8. Hope you guys are enjoying this series so far. And I hope we can get in there and sleep this man. And uh, hopefully become a killer again that we are known for in this division. We need to start sleeping people again. And uh, let's go. Let's do this. Okay. Oh, okay. Off the bat, Mark Baker coming with a vengeance. Trying to sleep this man early on. Oh, another head kick. He's nearly down. He's nearly down. He almost tried to take us down there, but we did manage to stuff that takedown. We're back up to our feet. Head kick was blocked. Nice. Good start by Mark Baker. He's looking fresh. He's looking very, very fresh. Trying to just fight smart. Eating a body kick there, though. Not great. Uppercut lands. Tried the overhand. He blocked it. Nice. Oh, that hurt him. And he's down. He could be out. He's out. He's out. Mark Baker with a first round finish. Is he back in the heavyweight division? We have to wait and see. But there we go. That is a phenomenal knockout win. Mark Baker puts himself back in the winning bracket tonight. And there we go. Is he back? We have to wait and see for a more challenging opponent. But uh, respect. We uh, we destroyed him. First round. Good straight there. We tried the uppercut. He was down. We wasn't giving him no chances though. We was making sure we have that win. Uh, we needed it after our devastating loss against Alistair Overeem in the last video. If you guys haven't checked that out yet, please go and check it out. It is an awesome episode. We did come up short in the final fight of the episode. But what can you do when you have two weeks damn training? Dana, you're full of shit. But there we go. Big Beast is right back on track. That was an amazing comeback fight. We are back in the winning bracket. Let's try and stay there, shall we? That is the plan. Um, yep, last fight was a fluke. Now you see the true colours of the Big Beast. I hope so. I hope so. Um, I, I kind of hope that um, that we can do stuff. I hope we can uh, destroy this man in the next fight. Okay, so Big Beast came up tonight. Came up big tonight. Sorry. Uh, amazing win. That will lead to some big things. I, I kind of hope so. Uh, I want to title fight. Whatever the UFC gives me, I'm ready for. I'm just here to fight. That is it. Mark Baker, an absolute warrior in the cage. Let's get in there. Let's see who we have next. I wouldn't mind a rematch with some good fighters, like maybe Derek Lewis again, because that was an absolute war last time. But I suppose that we're going to take whoever they give us. We're not going to duck anyone at all. But we could be fighting Alistair Overeem in this fight. Let's go. Big Beast got the win. Enough said. Big Beast absolutely destroyed uh, that last opponent. We have Alexander Volkov and we have Pip Short again. We're going to have a rematch with Volkov, I believe. Let's go. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's, uh, let's take this man out. Fingers crossed we can uh, get in there and do some damage. Uh, yeah, that's that's what I want the most. Uh, I think we're probably gonna go for a. Should we go for a? Let's go for another wrestling gym. Gonna carry on up in our game here as much as possible. And uh, fingers crossed we can block some takedowns. I think we destroyed Volkov in the first fight, but you know things change. Maybe he's a better fighter now. We we'll have to wait and see. Here we go though. Uh, we got some promotional stuff off the bat. We do have four. Uh, yeah, four weeks. So that's not too bad, I suppose. Uh, let's train. I think we're going to train some health because we are getting quite rocked. We're getting rocked quite a bit recently. Uh, even in training, it's not good. Uh, we're kind of kind of getting caught. Kind of getting caught slipping. So uh, we're going to get up. We're still not at maximum fitness, which is kind of annoying. I think we probably will be now. There we go. Okay, so we're going to spar. We're going to get fit. And then we're going to focus on uh, upping some skills and stuff. Uh, but yeah, it's all good. Everything is going pretty sweet. We have got some promotional stuff here, though. Um, oh god damn, we can't even spar now. Oh yeah, we can, we can. We can spar. Okay, let's go. The promotional stuff is kind of annoying, but um, it does add like a realism to it because obviously fighters do have to do this in real life, so. This is bullshit. Like, this is bullshit, bro. We need to stop um, getting rocked in training because that does take away longevity as well. And obviously, we, we want to get the best run out of Mark Baker we can possibly get. We need to stop throwing wild shots. We need to be patient. The patient Mark Baker that was there before the Ream fight. We're getting fucking slapped. Boom, boom. Way to block that. These dudes are tougher than the uh, actual opponents, bro. I don't know. Alistair Overeem was a very tough fight. Boom. Okay, we're not doing anything to this, bro. He's a beast. Oh, just fuck off. 
What is the fucking deal? God damn. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, fucking. How'd you fucking like it, you bitch? With your fucking mowalk thing. I can't really say anything. Mark Baker's got one as well, but Mark Baker's one looks a lot cooler. Trying to be aggressive. Good kick there. Okay, good start. Good start. Another good kick. It was meant to be a head kick, but we'll take it. If he rocks me, I'm going to be pissed. Is he going to pressure or what? I mean, my fitness is just ticking over, so... Good block. Oh, good body strike there. I'm trying to focus, because these guys are fucking harder than the others. Harder than the actual fights. It's crazy. This is probably the most boring spa you've ever seen. It's for me too. He's not really attacking. Are you fucking doing anything? Okay. Okay, we've well, still got 92 fitness out of that, so I'm not complaining. Um, but there you go. Let's uh, let's keep going. I think what I'm going to do, um, I, I will keep this training in, because it gives me a chance to talk to you guys about some of the upcoming series that are going to be on the channel. Uh, lately, we have got Far Cry 5. I think that is out in a few weeks, um, which is going to be badass. We've got Sea of Thieves in a few days, and uh, we have some more South Park DLC stuff on the way soon as well. Can't wait for all of that. If you guys do enjoy any of these games, make sure to hit that subscribe button, because there are going to be all the latest releases in 2018 on my channel. So, uh, yeah, where do we go from here? Blocking, we're up that a little bit. Because our strength our, uh, strength is all good, but our our health is not great. If we get cracked to the chin, we're going to feel it. So, I don't want that at all. So, um, we're going to go... I think we could probably promote a little bit more. We're not doing too good on the promotional side of things. Hand out flyers for the gym, all of that stuff. And then we have one more week of training. I'm just hoping we can get up some stuff. Uh, we've got some heart there. Heart is for body kicks and body strikes, I believe. So that is all good to get up. I may just spend this whole week on uh, trying to increase our health, our blocking, our toughness. Mark Baker is a tough cookie anyway. He's an absolute beast. Uh, we want to make sure he gets that strength uh, that he, he needs, really. We have lost quite a bit of longevity from that head kick KO, though, which is kind of annoying. But here we go. We are into the fight against Alexander Volkov. Let's do it again. Let's get in there. Let's throw down. 17-1 and one now. Let's go. Let's do this. Let's fucking do this. He's 19th professional mixed martial arts fight. Mark Baker has the rematch with a man he devastated in round two before. No way in the world is Big Beast capable of winning two in a row now. Here comes another loss. Big Beast can't win two in a row. We'll lose this one for sure. How bad is Big Beast? I think even I could beat him. Uh, two in a row for Big Beast? Nah. Dude. God damn. We need to start that winning streak again. It starts with two in a row, Big Beast, then three, four, five. Let's go. Let's get another win under our belt. We need to come back strong for the Alistair Overeem fight, and I think that is what we're going to do. Let's do it. What have you got? He was a beast in the first fight. Okay, no touch gloves then. All right. Okay, okay. Oh, okay. That hurt. We're looking way too patient in this. I don't know why. Oh, Big Beast with the strength. He's got power for days, bro. Good head kick block there. Uppercut really doing damage to Alexander Volkov. I'm going to stay on him. We're going to keep pressuring him. Good body strike there. Okay. He's not blocking, bro. Okay. He was trying something then. Oh, we clapped him there with a nice uppercut. Another... Was that an overhand? Yeah, it was. Okay. Body kick lands. Trying to be patient. Oh, the overhand. He's down. He's out. Call it ref. It's all over. Big Beast with another knockout win. Claiming a second win in a win streak that hopefully will not be broken for a very long time. Mark Baker back in the winning bracket again. Really redeeming himself after that first loss to Alistair Overeem. Good knock down there with a cracking right hook and a left that followed. And then we dived all over him. We made sure we closed the show very early. And now we have the fight we've all been waiting for. Alistair Overeem. We did just unlock another record. We broke another record in the UFC. I don't know if that is 15 finishes. So... Are we going to get like a UFC minute thing going on here? I think so. Maybe in a minute. 
Uh, did that fight even see that punch coming? I don't think so. Big Beast could jump into a boxing ring tomorrow and win titles with hands like that. Big Beast got those hands. We have indeed got those hands, and we've indeed got an ugly face as well. We are a one-hitter quitter. Uh, what is this? This is a gif. Okay. Cassie Chen. Uh, it's fun watching Big Beast do his thing on fight night. As we can see, they're absolutely pounding the dude's face in. But here we go. We have the big fight we've all been waiting for. Alistair Overeem gets another chance, or we get another chance to Alistair Overeem, and hopefully it is enough. This is a bitter rivalry, and I'm hoping we can climb back up and take this man out. This is going to be an awesome fight. I'm going to skip out all the training, and hopefully we've got more than two weeks, because that will really piss me off. But here we go. He beat us the first time. We're going to beat him the second time. I have no doubt in my mind. We're going to go in there with a full camp and uh, fuck this dude up. 18-1. 56 and 24. That is very impressive. 56 damn wins. But here we go. Mark Baker, Alistair Overeem. I will see you guys in a second on the fight. Okay, here we go. This is the fight we have all been waiting for. The rematch. Mark Baker gets his chance to get one back against Alistair Overeem. Can he do it? The fight hype is very high for this fight. I'm hoping that we get on there and uh, perform. So, fingers crossed, this is going to be a decent enough win to propel us into the top flight heavyweights and maybe even a title shot. Um, but, yeah, here we go. Mark Baker uh, hopefully going to shake up the world again tonight. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed indeed. We have done a lot of training. We have put in the work. Now we just have to wait and hopefully it pays off. Ricardo Lamas, uh, Big Beast is the real deal. Check him out tonight. We are indeed the real deal. Hopefully we can get a win though. That is all we want. That is all we want indeed. How bad is Big Beast? Even I, I, I think even I could beat him. Nah, I don't think so. Especially with his uh, spearhead of a face. That's uh, it's, it's not a chance. Here we go. The rematch we've all been waiting for. Alistair Overeem is ranked 5. We are ranked number 7. Can we get in there and make it one all tonight? We have faced this man before and is ended in brutal knockout for Mark Baker. He's a little bit scared about getting into this, but here we go. The battle is going to commence. Oh, that would hurt. Good foot by Mark Baker. Okay, okay. Tried to flick out a kick there. Good hook. Leg kicks are... Okay, okay. Oh, overhand. Kicked him as well. Baker putting on the pressure early. Baker's looking good. Oh, then clinches though. Okay. 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 Good head kick. I'm, I'm saying to throw punches and it's not working. Let's go, bitch. Oh, Alistair Overeem. We dropped him, I think, in the first. In the first fight, so... Oh, that kick would have hit him. Okay, not again. Elbow cracks Mark Baker. What a fight. Oh, get down. The overhand. The overhand finished him. Get down. Mark Baker avenges his loss with a brutal knockout of Alistair Overeem. There we go. We're back in the winning bracket again with a comeback episode indeed. There we go. Mark Baker proving to be one of the best in this division so far. There we go. What an overhand. Flattened Dallas to Overeem and put him down on the canvas. There was no getting up from that. Mark Baker made sure of it as well. Ending Alistair Overeem. What an overhand. I didn't even know if it would land. I just see a little bit of an opening there and it was enough to end the fight. Mark Baker has ended this bitter rivalry. We have broken into the top five and hopefully now we do get a new contract. I think obviously we have had three fights in this episode and they've all ended in the first round. Uh, but yeah, we're going to uh, we're gonna keep going. End of story, Baker ends over in rivalry with a spectacular knockout. The wait was long, but for Mark Baker, it was a sweet victory last night in New York, USA, as he knocked out Alistair Overeem to put an end to a bitter rivalry, taking advantage of a great training camp and intensity built up from the back and forth banter with his opponent. Baker was able... Baker was focused from the start, and when he landed the finishing blow, there was an outpouring emotion from Big, who secured the most satisfying win of his career. Um, I'd probably say that was as well. An amazing overhand, just a perfect overhand, and there we go. Congrats, Mark Baker. You're a real contender. I see a title shot in your near future. I hope so. We earned a new contract. It's just about time. Now we are a top contender. Okay. Now we need to defeat the champion. 
So I don't know where we are in the rankings. Stipe Miotic, I've heard champions ducking contenders, but I've never heard of a contender ducking a champion. You're a joke. Hashtag journeyman. Oh. Um, Breathe easy. I may go after a legit title holder. No, we can't say Stipe Miotic is a paper champ. He is an absolute beast. Um, I'll be ready for that belt soon. My goal is to become champion, and I will be ready when I get there. There we go. Stay humble. Stay humble. Let's go. Let's go. So, I don't know what they're going to offer us in this next fight. Um, I probably will take one more fight. And, uh, yeah, we've just hit a million fans as well, which is badass. Uh, it's 19 and 1 now. We still have a few more fights before we get to Stipe. So, we have three. Uh, Big Beast is a professional athlete. This isn't a tough man contest. Hashtag true pro. Exactly, Kevin Pender. You know it, my man. So, we have Andre Arlovsky. We have Ben Rothwell for the rematch. I think we're going to fight Andre Arlovsky just because we haven't faced him yet. And, uh, yeah, that should be a pretty decent fight. So, we're going to go ahead with the training. And, uh, hopefully, we can whoop this man and then get back into the... Um, get back into... Well, we're not even back into now. We are there. And now we can train at the kickboxing gym. That's something I've wanted to do for so damn long. Here we are. Let's learn some spinning shit. I want to learn some spinning kicks, some spinning heel kicks and stuff. That's going to be pretty badass when I land one of them on the dome of Stipe Miotic to gain the UFC heavyweight world title. We had a few setbacks in the career, but we are back now and uh, better than ever. But here we go. We probably have to promote some stuff off the bat. We do have seven or six weeks of training, so I'm not too worried about um, about losing like a few or missing a few weeks of training. We do have six of these, so we can probably wait a little bit. We can probably just chill for a little while. And uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's kind of cool. I think I'm going to just see if I can learn stuff off the bat. Uh, we have a spinning heel kick. That is exactly what I want to do. How do you do body roundhouse? See, cage flying knee. Oh, now we're getting into the good shit. Spinning side kick. Knock down your training partner in two minutes. Oh, okay. Okay, we can do that. We can do that. Uh, this should be kind of cool. Let's see if we're... I'm just going to rush this dude. Okay. Let's go, bitch. What you got? Okay, I just need to knock him out, I believe. That's it. Oh, dude, come on. Oh, my God. Okay, restart it. Restart it. This is terrible. We need to knock him out. Okay, let's go. Let's roll. Let's get that dude down. Okay. There we go. I think we've unlocked a spinning kick now. Get up, bitch. Oosh. Okay. Let's just keep kicking now because we are going to get some other stuff. There we go. We've got 10 kicks and we've managed to knock him down. I think we're going to get a load of stuff for that. No new moves. Wait, what? Why? He said we have to knock him down. Oh, we have to knock him down in two minutes, but we've got 30 seconds to do so. That makes no sense. Okay, let's just keep throwing kicks. I guess. All right. Is this going to knock him out? There we go. Did that work? What the fuck? Fuck off. This game sometimes. I don't understand. It told me I had to do it. Oh, fuck off. That doesn't make sense. What the fuck was that shit? We just wasted a load of points. I, I, I don't even know. It said to knock him out with kicks. Knock him down with kicks. And we knocked him down with kicks and we got nothing for it. That don't make no sense at all. But okay. Fair enough. Was we doing something wrong there? I want to see. I, 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 don't, I don't even know. Learn. Did it? Wait, so... Knock down your training partner in two minutes. Was that the one? We did that. We not. I don't, I don't understand. I, I. Whatever. Um. Guillotine, side kick, spinning heel kick. Knock down your partner with a head kick in 30 seconds. Okay, we can try that. Let's go. 30 fucking seconds. Let's do it. We get a, wait, what? What the fuck? How are we supposed to knock anyone down from here? All right, relax. We gotta work harder in that position. This don't make no sense. Bro, what the, how are we supposed to knock him, this doesn't make sense, yeah, knock him down, all right, full mount here, submissions only, oh, okay, okay, Let's 
get tighter in that half. We court. actually don't do a lot of submissions, so we're gonna see if we can submit Stefan. Oh, we're naked. Oh yeah, bitch. A little bit. Push yourself. No shit. I suck ass. I suck fucking ass at this. Come on, you know better than that. This game doesn't make sense. Get your leg out of there, reclaim half. Okay. Half guard. Get on that top mount position. Let's go for the Gar Gargo Plata. Sounds like a fucking drink. This just beats facing. Oh, we can't. We can't even punch him. This is shit. Position. What are you doing? I don't understand what. I don't on, understand. How are we supposed to knock him down with a head kick when we're? I, I don't. I don't know. I don't understand. We couldn't even get up. Like, what is going on? No, like, I don't. I, we're just wasting points here. I don't, it says we need to knock him out of a head kick, and then we're training on the floor. Like, what? I don't. I don't understand. Am I an idiot or what? I mean, probably. You know what? Fuck it. No more learning. Let's just fucking get into the sparring. We've wasted too many points on this already. Uh, let's just go. Let's let's spar. This is fucking weird. I don't understand. But okay, fair enough. Oh, I've missed you, Ginger Man. Oh my God. <laughs> Jesus, that was insane. Boom. Get that. <laughs> He's just not like the others, is he? Come on. Boom. Way to block. <laughs> oh my god. I bet he sees Mark Baker walking into the gym. He's like, oh, fuck no. No, not today. <laughs> oh, if we can knock him down again. <laughs> yes, we knocked him out. Oh my god. Jesus. Oh, he's still got a spar, okay. Boom. He's not doing nothing. Oh, okay. He caught us. Oh, okay. He's down again. He's just recovered from being knocked the fuck out, and now he's being asked to spar again. Okay, fair enough. Alright, there we go. That was pretty sweet, though. Uh, an awesome training session, probably one of the best. Uh, uppercuts of trouble for this opponent. Sway low combo of an uppercut. They will not see it coming, okay? I think we have like level 5 uppercuts as well, so that is really nice. We're probably going to land that, and I think that is going to put him away. That is a uh, little bit of a bonus, I guess. Okay, so we don't have that many... Uh, we have got still quite a lot of weeks to go, so it's going to be a shit ton of promoting, a shit ton of just upping our stats. As you can see, I think we are only in the second week, so... Uh, not too bad. Now we're in the third. I think we're just going to go ahead and just... I think we're going to go and just keep increasing our fight hype. Hopefully gain some more fans. Post to social media. All that good stuff. I may even predict the fight. I, I think it's going to end in round... I'm going to say round two. I'm going to say round two knockout. There we go. That is my prediction. I think that's going to come true. But there we go. Let's, uh, let's just go down to here. I think we're going to go and try and increase some more ground game there. As you can see, the bottom game is kind of low. I'd like to get the blocking up a little bit as well, just to make sure we are covered up. If we do get rocked, we can uh, cover our head up. Andre Olofsky is an old veteran and uh, a beast as well, but Mark Baker is a different kind of animal. We've just hit a million followers as well. I just realised that. I think I may have realised that earlier, and it's just uh, I forgot. But, uh, yeah, let's go. Let's get into this. I'm trying to make this just uh, cut down as quick as possible. Kind of taking a while. Let's get rid of that body strength. Let's get that up as much as possible as well. Because we do get kicked to the body quite a lot. And uh, it's probably best we do uh, increase that. Because we do eat a lot of body strikes. Um, I don't know if that's just because of his belly. Maybe they want to attack him because he's got a big belly. But you never know. Maybe it's because he looks like a ninja turtle. I have no idea. But yeah, let's do another post of social media. We're pretty much ready for this fight. This is going to be an absolute war. And hopefully Mark Baker is the one coming out on win with the win. That is the... Uh, Probably the most important thing, I'd imagine. <coughs> Excuse me. God damn. I'm coming down with a cold. That's why my commentary today is a little bit shit. I'm not going to lie. But uh, here we go. 
endurance and all that stuff. We're just going to increase quite a bit. 99 stamina now. We can we can sit in there all day and we can go all day long. All day long, Mark Baker can go. Uh, yeah, let's go. Let's uh, clinch throws, 97. All good. 101 peak fitness. We are there. We are ready. And uh, we just got to wait, I think, maybe two more weeks, is it? Or are we done? Are we done? Okay, the last week. So I guess for this, we're just going to keep promoting. Do as much of that as possible. Um, is there anything else we can do for fight hype? We'll do that. There we go. It's just that gif of us smashing that poor ginger man again. Uh, but for that, I don't think there is anything else I'd like to increase. Everything is pretty much in the 90s. We're going to go for that. We're going to go and try and get 100 power. Hell yeah. Absolutely just amazing power. There we go. 100 endurance as well. 100 stamina now, which is great. Uh, we do that. We do some blocking, some clinch grapple as well. But I think we are ready for this fight. We are really ready for this fight. We're going to get in there, throw some bombs, hopefully finish Andrei Arlovsky, and then we're on to the next one. Advance to the fight. Let's get in there. The fight hype should be very high. I'm not too sure. Mark Baker ready for another war. I think this is his 21st professional mixed martial arts belt. Can he get in there and get the win? After a dominant win against uh, Alistair Overeem, Alexander Volkov, and I think it was Alexi, Alexi Olen Olenki. I, I don't actually know how to say that name. I've never heard of him fighting, but um, he does seem like pretty much a beast. Go punch something. I will teach you Torres. Don't worry. Let's do this. Let's get in there. Hopefully get a win and uh, proceed to chase that title. We, I think we've got four fights. If we win all of these fights, we are going to get a title shot. But here we go. What is this? I'm Megan Olivi, and this is your UFC Minute. We've seen some of the top fighters in the world go from relatively unknown to some of the biggest names in the sport. Oh, yeah. There's a big difference between being a successful fighter in the UFC and being a star. But this fighter has clearly found the oh. formula to be both. As several impressive wins in the octagon have seen him make his way up the heavyweight ladder and capture the imagination of fans eager to see him perform on the sport's biggest stage. That's it for today. Stay tuned for your next UFC Minute, and I'll see you at the fights. Here we go. Andre Arlovsky, Mark Baker, let's get in there. Let's face off. This is going to be an awesome fight. He eats a lot of uppercuts, though. Mark Baker throws a lot of uppercuts, so this is going to be deadly. Oh, okay. Oh, boom, boom. Uppercut lands and puts him down. There we go. I like Mark Baker's stance. I like his high, his high guard. Okay. Boom. So Arlovsky's shot is blocked. That's a powerful hook to the head. Oh, okay. Let's just focus. Oh. Boom. Oh, oh eight head kick there though. Not bad. Oh. oh he might be out. Trying to plant him. There we go. He's planted. Oh, we're, we're getting that killer instinct back. Mark Baker looking like such a threat. Okay. Overhand. Uppercut. There we go. He's down again. The uppercut. Every single uppercut we've thrown tonight has dropped Andre Arlovsky in the first round. God damn, this is crazy. See that coming. And again, he's rocked. Uppercut's really causing him trouble. Mark Baker looking like a threat. Good head kick though. And again, okay. Need to cover up a little bit. And again. Down again. This is crazy. Body kick lands there. Nice. He was going to throw a kick there, but he never in the end. Uppercut again. He's out. Andre Arlovsky. Is down and out with a first round knockout from the big beast. And as we can see there, he is very, very happy with himself. I would be after that as well. He's back. He is back. And maybe we're going to change him a little bit. Maybe we're going to change him in the next episode. Maybe some new tattoos. Maybe a new hairstyle. Maybe a new beard style. But he is back. And as we can see there, 17 finishes in the UFC. Absolute. Just an amazing fighter. Can we carry on with this win streak? I think so. Um, after losing to Alistair Overeem, he was a little bit patient to start things off. But he has turned into an absolute knockout artist. 
Uh, if he was in the, he was already. Brian Ortega actually tweeting us there. Nice fight. Congrats. You're almost there. We are almost there indeed. But he's turning into a little bit more of a aggressive fighter. We like to sit back with Mark Baker in the uh, early hours of his career, but now he is, uh, he's here. He's here and he is ready. So, uh, okay, big win tonight. How do you see the fight with the champ paying out? Okay, Ali said it best. I'm young and pretty dumb. We, we can't say that. Mark Baker is the ugliest man on this roster. So, we can't say that. Uh, it's going to be a tough fight, but those are challenges I love. Hashtag can't wait. One small step to my super fight. Chasing two belts. Nope, we're going to go for that. It's going to be a tough fight. Uh, I'm the champ. I'm going to stay the champ. But let's put on a show for these fans. Uh, it's going to be fun. Can't wait for fight night. Won't be easy. I can't wait to get my first belt. Okay, we're gonna, uh, we're both gonna bring it. That's for sure. Let's do it. Let's have a war, Stepe. Stepe is probably gonna be the toughest fight. Uh, we after beating Alistair Overeem, I thought Alistair Overeem fought really, really well in the first fight. But uh, yeah, let's see where we are in the rankings. Let's see who we could potentially be facing in the next uh, few episodes. So we do have Alexis somehow higher than us. We did beat him though, so I don't really understand that. Fabricio Radum, I would like to fight him as well. And Cain Velasquez, another fight I'd like to take. Uh, but yeah, that, that is pretty much it. Um, we're going to see who they offer us. And we're going to do the usual thing. Who do you guys want us to fight in episode number nine? You guys can be the uh, choice. Who do you think we're going to be fighting? Let's find out. Fabricio Verdum is a fight I would like. I think he's fighting this weekend, actually. And... Uh, Ben Rothwell and Aleski. We could fight Aleski again, but we have beaten once already. Uh, I would like to fight Fabricio over Doom because he is a new face. We haven't fought before, but that is up to you guys. Thank you so much for watching. We are going to end this video here. If you did enjoy the video, please smash that like button, comment and subscribe, and I'll see you from what EA Sports UFC 3 next time. Stay awesome, guys. Have a great day, and I'll see you all in the next video.